Hello? We're playing the best Call of Duty game ever today. It is Call of Duty Vanguard. Oh. I can't even do an intro to try to get hyped or interested in this game. <laughs> I tried. I really did. Before you leave, though, because I know no one wants to watch Vanguard, Code Merc is currently 30% off of G Fuel from now up until the 28th. Use it or lose it, just like a banana peel. What? But yeah, even though I haven't uploaded Vanguard in over a month to the main channel, I figured I'd get on here. They're having Season 2 reloaded. And there's a new game mode called Arms Race, which actually sounds kind of neat. Think of it like Warzone, but it's not Warzone, and it's not... anything. <laughs> this is gonna be a good video, isn't it? But before we play this filthy game, we gotta do some reviewing. Looking at the Vanguard bundle to see if they suck ass! Featured bundle right here is called Black Ice. Um, I don't care about any of this. This all looks bad. Toxic Valkyrie. Let's see if this is any good. Oh, yes, the skin of someone who cleans up after Shrek's shits. Lovely skin that looks very good. Radioactive shower operator finishing move. Oh, I've seen this one before. This looks like Caustic from Apex Legends. Bayou Bruiser. We got a Padmavati skin. I mean, th this one is actually not too bad. I don't know. That I like ghillie suits. This isn't really a ghillie suit. I mean, it looks like a seaweed salad on her shoulders, but <laughs> there's worse skins. This is the closest thing we have to an anime calling card, if it's not already. I don't know. Oh, we got the Attack on Titan bundle. The only thing that's actually good in this game. Obviously, in my last video, when I was talking about Snoop Dogg coming to COD Mobile Vanguard of Warzone, I was saying that he's just... You know, all this stuff is in the wrong games, man. This is actually a nice skin, but who fucking cares about Vanguard? Like, nope. I'm sorry. The skins are awesome. The gun's awesome. Oh my god. It's just in a game that I really don't care about. I'm sorry. If you like Vanguard, that's cool. I just, I don't. It really does feel like a waste, though. <laughs> like, uh, unstoppable force. I don't have the skins, so. Oh, wait. Oh. Okay, yeah, that's that's looking moist. I like that. Crimson Fang. Shovel Sweep. Daniel move. Cool. I mean, he's looking kind of suave here. I dig the eye patch. I don't know why he's suddenly missing his eye, but yeah, okay. Sky Stalker. Don't care. Ruthless precision? Oh, no. Where's my anime skin? Wait, pack leader? What is this? Oh my god, what is that? What are these futuristic tattoos? This is what I'm saying, man. Does this look like a World War II game slash skin to you? I don't think so. What the f*** is this? Fenrir Unchained. <laughs> I got the wolf from ghosts on this one. Sounded disgusting. Chemical response? Very boring. No one cares. Out of the wreckage, again, terrible. I think that's it for the skin vanguard bundle, review bundle. What I really don't understand about the decisions for the skins and the bundles in this game is that they're like one of two things. They're either rancid dog shit, just like boring, no one would ever spend money on this kind of bundles, and then they're like these over-the-top ones that really don't belong in a World War II game kind of bundles. Where is the healthy in-between? I mean, just look at Modern Warfare Remastered. Like, everyone was very worried about how the skins and like the different things for the guns were gonna turn out, and they were actually pretty good. At least as far as I remember, there was nothing too over-the-top actually fit the game and you know it was actually kind of worth putting some money in if you wanted to because it actually made sense for the game but yeah i'm gonna shut up about skins now let's go play arms race there's a new person in the game his name is gustavo those are some great looking eyes we got 2009 eric death stare here excuse me <laughs> wearing a ghillie suit he heard that dude oh my god why does his ghillie suit look like the things you find at a car wash here's his bio he's brazilian he likes to go ballroom dancing, but he also drinks and gambles. I know tons of Brazilian people who have these exact same hobbies, so don't question it. It's a very common thing. Capture all the bases to win. Oh, here we go. We're playing on the map called Alps. This is a new map, obviously. Whoa, you can actually pick where you spawn? What is this, Roblox? Oh, dude, I'm in a car. What? Wait, do I not? I don't think I can pick a class. What? Wait, hold up. I want to drive. Give me the motorcycle. Why is it already dead? Stop doing that. I didn't pay. Why can't I move? Aaron Yoker. What, what was Levi doing there? That was so ugly. Yeah, so I've never played this, so don't judge me, but I also don't know what the hell's going on. A there. tank? Come back! Come I'm here! Outside. Come here! What? I can't get in. What the what is yeah. why is this tank so fast? Oh my. I didn't mean to do that. It's okay. pushing me! Alright, we'll spawn at sea. It looks like you just always spawn in with the same guns, as far as I know. Buy station. Oh, you can buy stuff. Oh, this is war zone. Get the nebula crate! Nebula crate! Mine, I want it. Oh, I thought I saw someone fall here. What? I'm taking it. This is mine. Why do you get out of this? Supply so drops? Ooh, I get. Oh, I have to deliver it to a friendly base. Oh, get it. Oh, I did it. Oh, let's destroy D. We win. What? What is this? Oh, you can buy your custom classes. Oh, neat. I can't actually afford it, but yeah. Why wasn't this mode in the game at launch? People might have cared more about this game. Also, it looks like we destroyed their only spawn. So, like, where do they go now? I want some kills. There we go. Oh, I'm so good. Warzone, Warzone. Get to the nebula crate. Get to it. Get that nebula crate. Eh, I don't really want the nebula crate. I want to run people over. Where are they? 
Oh my god, I flipped! Alright, I guess I'll get the nebula crates. I think an enemy just landed near me, but they failed. Oh shit. Go! Deliver that crate, son. I don't really know what you're supposed to do. Like, am, am I doing the most important thing right now? Because I get to destroy a base. Like, look at that. We're gonna destroy E. Do I get anything for blowing it up, though? Got a free takedown. Let me do it. It makes you wonder why they wait so long to put cool shit like this in the game. How do people get keep getting tanks? This place is just shitting the tanks out. Oh, wait. Oh, that's how. Buy station. How much is a tank? 1,200? Yes, please. Oh, I've got the tank now. Call of Duty tank ops. Oh, yes. Dink tank, bro. Break that armor. Get him. He doesn't even know what's going on. Eh, I got him. I got legendary COD points for that. Whoa. I broke the armor. You're dead. This game mode is basically who can get a tank first and then just destroy the other team. Headshot him. Oh, you can get a tank headshot. Nice. Press F for the other team because we fucking won. That was incredible. They try to make their eyes look different. Why are they're all of their eyes blue now? When did that become a thing? Trying to make them look better at the end. Before that game started, I was also going to say that there's a new SMG. It's called the Armor Guerra 43. You have to get 10 hip fire kills in a single game 15 times. Let's see what the zombies challenge is. Oh. Okay. In zombies, kill frozen zombies 400 times. I don't know if that's hard or not. I, I don't really care to do either. But they do have DOS House 24-7, so that'd be a pretty easy place to do it. <laughs> what is wrong with this child's mic? Getting those hip fires. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh my life. What? What is this man singing? Oh my life. <laughs> <laughs> this game is oh, fucking weird, dude. What? You can get pushed by your teammates? I got shoved. I literally got- I literally got shoved and eaten by a dog now. This game is so lit! Oh, hip fires! Too bad you can't just get it all done in like one match. Gotta play what, 10, 15 games to really drag it out? Make you wanna buy the skin? Oh my god, Vanguard's so boring, dude. This gun literally has a nutsack. What's even happening anymore? Oh, there's me though. Most limbs. Can't say most kills, it's most eliminations. <laughs> Best a limb to D ratio. <laughs> I'll have that new gun in no time. Only 14 more games of that. I, I don't I don't think I'll be getting that done. Yeah, that's pretty much all that there is that's new in Vanguard. I mean, granted, DOS House is not new, but I'll play other games of Arm Race, but I mean, I really can't handle that much of this game, man. The only thing I care about and want to see in Vanguard is gun games, so I can try to go for some gun game reactions, but I also kind of feel like they're either just not going to add it out of spite or it's not going to be as good as previous versions of gun game. Like, it might be really hard to actually melee and set people back, but we'll see. You never know. Until then, I don't have anything to do on this game, man. I, I don't care. Open attack map. Where are we going, bud? Where are we dropping? Where are you? Dropping, where we dropping, where we dropping? You want where we D? Have, yeah, I'll you go have, D. You have, you have, you have, leave the airplane! I'm not going where they said to go. I'm capturing Eric Flag. Oh, I can take it from here. We got it! Oh no! Get up! Okay. What? We look at this sick dirt bike moves. Even though it's not like the best, I, I'll at least give them props for trying something new here. Like sure, this might not be the best game mode they've ever done for Call of Duty, but it's something new. They're trying. Game still puts me to sleep, but I mean, at least it's something different. T-bag. Oh, they got a tunk. Dude, I'm going in. No, I'm not, I'm dead. <laughs> I don't know why I can't remember this exactly, but didn't we have a mode like this in Cold War? It's kind of like playing Warzone, but you're able to respawn. And there's different objectives and shit. Like, it's not just about, like, killing the last couple people left. Shoot the tank! I disabled it! You came and shoot me! You're garbage! You're dead. MG42 is a great choice. I'm going in! Nope. Ow! Dude, I actually got a quad feed in this thing. What? I know it's with an LMG, but I mean, still. Gotta shred through four people's armor and sh- It's not bad. Not bad at all. Skirt, skirt! Whee! I feel like in Cold War, that would've just blown up right there. At least they made the vehicles more realistic. They're gonna get- They got the nebula. Oh, we're fucked. I got him! Yes! Ah, uh, they're probably still gonna get it, but I mean, I tried to stop him. 
Gotta try, come on. Spray him down! This is my second time playing this mode, and I feel like I know this game mode better than, like, everyone else in here on this team. Like, what are we doing? Out to the trolley, bonker! Oh, a UFO's coming to suck us up. Disable the tank, disable the tank. <laughs> I died to the Predator missile. Oh, no, it's a glide bomb, yes. Oh! The tank sees us. But <laughs> He's dead! <laughs> He was just still sitting there, it looks so weird. Hey, your boy got play. Lost the game, but I mean, at least I did this. Nasty this game, and, I, and I'm still blurry. They still haven't even fixed that. But since that's all the Call of Duty Vanguard I can handle playing, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this random little COD Vanguard video. If you guys somehow managed to enjoy this video, and for some sick and twisted reason you want to see some more Vanguard stuff, make sure to drop a like. I'll see you guys later. We are taking the lead! A bomb's been planted on our ammo supply. A bomb's been